Hey everyone, I'm Nog and welcome back to Satisfactory. In the last couple of episodes we have been doing quite a bit of exploring and one of the things we found was some uh, hard drives, we found three of them. And also on the way home in the last episode, uh, or after the last episode, I actually found a couple more purple power slugs, so we have four of them now. That's 20 of our power shards right there. And we have six green slugs and uh, two yellow slugs. So that should be a total of 30 uh, power shards on top of the 18 that we already have. So that's really nice. Uh, so, But before we get into what we're going to do in this episode, let's take a look at the MAM. We have analyzed Quickwire. So that's good. New technologies have been developed based on this new element, primarily in power and electronics, and can now be accessed in Hub Tier 5. Outstanding. And I want to shove... Uh, let's just make sure. We have researched the purple power slugs, haven't we? No, we haven't. Dang it. Okay. Let's research uh, purple power slugs so that we can start uh, converting those. Let's uh, do these now. Get some more power shards. So that's 15 on top. That's what? 43. Do we have any power slugs in any of our. Oops. I don't think so. Oh, yeah. There's a power slug. Purple one. So, yeah. We have quite a few power shards and that is really nice. Let's have a look at what the uh, tier 5 stuff was. Material electronics, smart splitter, AI limiter, supercomputer and high speed connector. Very cool. Very cool indeed. Uh, let's see what do we have that is really easy to research. The object scanner or nuts let's just do that done and berries just two berries i think we can do that let's do it and stick a couple of berries in there where are they there do that so we've unlocked those very good. Uh, rebar gun, we could do. Nah. We're, we're going to go and do what we're supposed to be doing in this episode. Now, while we wait for the purple power slug to be done. Uh, let's just check our inventory space. Seems okay. So, so what we're going to do in this episode is... We have set up the entire iron rod uh, production facility, but we are producing nowhere near enough uh, iron ingots to actually be able to uh, support it or supply it. So what we're going to do is, because we have, here we have a miner mod 2, which produces 120, and we actually have uh, two more iron nodes Encroaching? Uh, Why is it encroaching? No. Okay. So uh, I guess it's just gonna be the one for now. Uh, let's try this again. There. Stick you in there. And. We can power you up right here. These things are so loud. Right, so that's one of the things that we're going to do. Next, we're going to tear out this. Whoops, not that. And tear out these. And tear out those. And then we're going to... Tear out those. And let's just stick that wall in there again before I forget. There, and then I want to stick a, let's just do a, doesn't matter, 
Then we can do it like that. Whoa. Hold down. Alright. So what we're gonna do here is first of all we are going to stick a wall, bare wall in here. And we're gonna stick a regular wall in there. And then I'm going to go up top. I uh, can't do that this way. That's also something that we need to fix sometime because having to go all the way around doesn't really make sense. So I'm going to fix that eventually. A little quick save there, I think. Auto save. And what we're going to do is. Whoa. Well, oh, let's jump in. There. I guess I shouldn't have put in that wall. Fine. And let's just set up our uh, hot bar here. So logistics, we want, might want to use those. We definitely want to use both the, the uh, regular conveyor lift and the Mark IV conveyor lift. And then we need walls, uh, just regular walls, and maybe conveyor walls, like that. Alright, that's fine. So what I want to do is, I want to get a uh, Mark IV from there, and I want to turn it around, like that, is that the right spot? It absolutely is not. Okay. So it's, it's there. That's the right spot. No, that's the same spot as before. Well done. And I guess it's there then. Yeah. I'm gonna get that going up here. And then we're going to have a regular conveyor lift. And that is going to be going up and in here. Like so. You can come out. Uh, you can come out for now. Alright. So, what I really want to do is... I want... Uh, I fell down into a black hole. I had no idea that black hole was there. Okay. Let's put that back in. Uh, while we're down here... Whoa, what happened there? <laughs> See that truck? It just went flying. Did it get back up? Yes, it did. Okay. Fine. Uh, so this is going to be going into the regular conveyor. And we need to merge these two. So we need a merger. We actually need to merge three items into this three belts into this eventually so or do we because if we stick a couple of power shards into this then we get it up to 240 which is good and then we can stick a couple of power shards into this so that's 120 that's 180 so that's 420, so we need one more power shard. We need to get it up to 430. Or, what? 210, actually. Because this is 240, and that needs to be 210. So, yeah. And then we have one more, so we're going to need to stick one more conveyor wall in here, and 
but we can fix that later. Okay, so let's get a merger. And we will place that. Uh, let's remove this. Oh. What are you doing? Just place the conveyor merger right here. Where does it line up? Didn't give me a lining up icon. Guess we'll do that. Come on, man, fix yourself. This thing is completely and utterly stuck. Never mind, it'll fix itself eventually. Nothing else than when we uh, re log in. Right. That's not good. We need to come out one more. There. And then we can get. What are you doing there? Trucks are going crazy. Okay. Let's bring you out here. And come into there. And the Mark 4 one is this one over here. So let's see, can we nope. We can get you up there. And then we can get you into this. So that works. And what we can actually do is just delete that. Perhaps are going crazy again. But I know how to fix it, I think. I just need to do it. Put it upright, at least. No, no, no. Don't. Let's... Yeah. Stupid trucks. The trucks aren't really the brightest in the world. Where are you going? Now go that way. Fine. Okay. Uh, next we need the fuel to come in. And we'll do Mark 4 belts for that as well. I think, yeah. And we can do like that, and then maybe we can just do like that. Yeah, perfect. So if we're doing Mark IV belts, then we might as well make that Mark IV as well. And let's get up top. And get everything else upgraded to Mark IV as well. Let's see if we can jump in here. Come on. There we go. So all of this stuff is just Mark 1 belts. Alright, so... You... Come out here. And then you go... And connect up to that. Should be straight. Yeah. And you... Come out here. And hook into that. I pulled it out one too far. There. And... Hook into that. Now that will not do. So what we're gonna do is we are going to put another conveyor lift in like so and then it's gonna hook into this all right and we need to upgrade all of this pedal this. we'll just upgrade it all it doesn't matter 
We have plenty of uh, what's it called Mark IV belt. Encased industrial beams available, so let's see if this is more. All right. So we are producing. Okay. And all of this is fine. This needs to be Mark IV. Little lag. All right. And a conveyor lift mark four. There we go. All right. Next level. And we need to make everything up here, mark four as well. So that we get full production throughput, right? Alright. Pretty fast to do. It's really nice that you can just upgrade and you don't have to take them out and put them in again. So, there we go. And here, whoa, I didn't want to jump down. My bad. Back up. Where did I jump down? Oh, there. Okay, fair enough. Go there, 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 there. We're running out of encased industrial beams, but that's okay. We have. Plenty in storage. Okay. So I'll do this one as well. Alright. So that means that we now have because these guys produce 30 a minute and we have 15 of them, I think. Yeah, 15 of them. So that's 450. Which means that we are now producing a lot more um, iron ingots, but not enough. We actually need to triple this, at least for now. Yeah. I actually think we need to quadruple it. Yeah, we do need to quadruple it, uh, but we're going to do that a little bit later. Okay, so this is done. We have upgraded that, and we have a truck <laughs> hopelessly stuck there. We do have fuel coming in, we have all of the ore coming in. Actually, we need to get down there. Can I jump down somewhere without dying? Probably not. Yeah, without dying I can. We need to upgrade this. So let's see, it's doing uh, 180. We need it to be doing 210. One, what, 180? It's 216, 175. That's 210. So this is doing 240. The other one is doing 210, that's 450. So that's one fully saturated Mark IV belt. Very nice. And we do have another node here which can do 300. If we triple, uh, put three power shards in there. And we have more iron ore around the place. Look at this crap. Yeah. So. Uh, we have increased that production quite a bit, and we're going to increase it more, but that is going to have to be in the next episode, because we are basically out of time. 
uh, but a little bit of progress and we are back to building instead of exploring so that's nice actually before we end the episode let's just go and take a look at the ma'am because i always forget and i don't want to forget so let's take a look at the ma'am and see uh, uh, and stick the hard drive in there so we know what the ma'am is going to produce now it's going to give us uh, purple uh, power shard conversion so let's have a look yeah thank you very much ada incoming message the crystals on this slug can be harvested and converted into five power shards that function with current fixit technology several buildings would be capable of performing over 100 percent capacity if infused the derived blueprint is now accessible in hub tier 3. very good thank you ada in with the hard drive, start doing that. And let's see, purple power shards. We basically just need some wire and some rotors. Do we have that? We have the wire. I'm not sure that we have the rotors though. Let's delete those. I am not sure that we have any rotors. I don't think we do. Yeah, we do. Excellent. Alright, let's unlock the purple power shards. Rotors, wire, and there. Outstanding. And then we can grab our purple power shards, which we put in... Where do we put them? Where do we put them? There they are. Oh, he's off. Very nice. Oops. And let's turn those. Can we just research power shard three? Oh, they're power shard part. So let's craft those and get up to a total of 44 power shards now excellent okay so uh thank you very much for watching guys i hope you enjoyed it if you did why not leave a like and maybe subscribe and i'll see you next time